Good morning, everyone. Good morning, up at six, and I have a cycling class at 6.30, so I just have a lot to do today, and I really wanted to work out because I didn't really, I had a, a fun weekend, but I consumed a lot this weekend, so I am just very, very like feel gross. So I was like, I need to go to the gym today. So I am headed off to the gym at 6.30, but I have to like start working and I wanna be at the wing by like 8.45. So this was just a class that worked out for me. It's still dark outside. I've, I haven't gone to the gym this early in so long and it's still like pitch black outside, which I hate walking in the morning when it's super dark. I don't know why I do, I don't. I don't know. I'm about to refill my water bottle. I have kind of like a headache. I think it's honestly just from like waking up early. And I am going to go to the gym. I'll show you guys my outfit. So I'm all bundled up. Eve last week it was like freezing in New York. I'm wearing this jacket from Athleta. Um, my leggings are Fabletics. And then my Nike shoes. And I'm off to do some cycling. <laughs> back from cycling and I just showered and I put some dry shampoo in my hair because you guys know I do not like washing my hair every single day and I washed it last night so I'm like mm, it's good enough with some dry shampoo in it anyways I am now about to go get breakfast I've been trying to figure out what to wear because I do have to take a sponsored picture today and it's an Ariana Grande perfume so I was like wanting to wear kind of like Ariana Grande stuff so I have this NASA shirt which I think is fitting because she does have a song called NASA or NASA which is actually one of my favorite songs from her so I thought that this was fitting and I might do like a sweatshirt or something like that I don't know we'll see I'll figure it out that is the plan for today so um that's not all I'm doing today but that is one of the things I'm doing today so I'm trying to get ready I'm gonna make some breakfast really quickly because I do think I'm kind of in a rush I have like 45 minutes to be totally ready so kind of <laughs> ready for the day and instead of going to the wing for my first consultation I'm gonna take the first one at 9 a.m. in my apartment because right now it's 8 30 and I don't really feel like rushing so I'm just gonna do it in my apartment but I'm glad that I got ready for the day because it is 8 30 I do want to prep for it so I already did like the document and everything and like went over everything that um just like from her website or her Instagram and stuff like that but I am just going to kind of look over that just so I like make sure I know what I'm talking about when I get on the call with her at 9 a.m. and I'm pretty sure she is from Singapore which is really cool that's why I do have these I guess like earlier sessions like there's one at 9 a.m. and then I have one that goes up until 6 p.m. so sometimes it's kind of hard for me because at 6 p.m. I'm like I just want to be done um but I do understand that I have clients that are from everywhere else so that just works for me and I know I could open it up to more people and make it earlier or later but just like for my own life I don't think that that would bring me any joy at all I think I would end up like like resenting the job so this just works for me and yeah <laughs> I just got ready. I'm wearing this sweatshirt. I feel like um, Ariana Grande would wear a sweatshirt. I'm not trying to look like Ariana Grande. I'm just trying to get some Ari vibes, you know? So I did like a little hair clip, like just things that kind of represent her, but I'm not like doing my makeup like her or anything like that, if that makes sense. But yeah, just jeans. I'm gonna wear my Doc Martens because it is a gloomy day in New York City. And yeah, I should probably like start getting ready and like getting my laptop out and prepping for the, the consultation. <music> So I just finished up my first consultation of the day. Um, she got on at like 8.50, so it was perfect. So now I'm done by 9.50, except 10, so 10 minutes. I actually, in the meantime, did take some pictures for the Ariana Grande perfume that I do have to do a sponsored post with. So I got a few of those out of the way. I am gonna try to take a few more. So I'm either gonna ask my roommate to help me or just set up a tripod because it's just might be a little easier to set up a tripod to take the rest of the photos. And then I'm going to head over to the wing. I'm gonna try to be there by like, 10 30 well definitely before 11 gonna try to be there before 10 45 because i do have um a meeting with my 
assistant i'm just like going over some things because she's been like really really helpful so just want to make sure that we're on the same page now with like the new things that i've been having to do i am going to try to take a few more photos of the perfume just to like get that out of the way and then i'm going to head over to the wing this was the setup so i have this tripod i'll have it linked down below on my amazon store but it's amazing it's a bluetooth tripod so you just connect it to a remote and then you can like take pictures um and it's literally like the most portable thing ever so you just there look how tiny i love the noise outside my room <laughs> it's amazing but yeah these were these were my props a lot of you guys have been asking me how I make my coffee, so I'm taking this to go. So I make it with this Nespresso machine. I've had this since college. I think I've had it since like junior year of college. It's literally the greatest coffee maker ever. Um, I love it. I've had no problems with it. It's tiny enough that it fits like in any tiny kitchen or in a dorm or whatever. Um, but it makes espresso because I don't like coffee. Like I don't like just black coffee. I always get lattes. So this makes espresso and then that's how much in the big serving. And then it comes with a milk frother. So I'm going to have it linked in my Amazon store as well. It's literally the best purchase ever. It's less than $200 and it saves you so much money because lattes are so freaking expensive. And I literally never go out to eat anymore or go and buy coffee anymore. Then you just pour it and I frothed oat milk in it. And yeah, there you have it. There's a coffee. <laughs> for it my assistant came we got over we went over like all of that stuff that we had to get go over she's awesome um and now i just finished my third consultation of the day and i just have one more so i'm really excited today has blown by it's already 3 p.m and i really want to film this video it's like structuring my day but it's been hard when i've just been like on meetings all day but yeah it was it's been fun though i feel like every time i have a bunch of consultations in a row my throat hurts because i'm talking so much so that's kind of it's kind of embarrassing but still working have one more hour finish working i just uploaded a video and then i will be going home at five o'clock i just sent in the ariana grande sponsored content so i hope they approve it with my caption right here let me know if you guys like when i like share with you guys my sponsored stuff and like how i do it and sending it out to the brand i think it's pretty interesting i feel like if i was not doing youtube i would find it interesting interesting and i still like seeing what other people are doing so if you guys are if you guys enjoy that type of content then let me know i'm getting tired you guys i might go and get some coffee they have free coffee here so i think i'm gonna get some it's 3 30 so i don't want to have coffee any later than this but i did wake up early so i'm gonna go get some of the free stuff tell them it'll come within 24 hours so it's totally fine if i send the stuff in tomorrow morning basically i just upload the document and the zoom recording and send it over to them and then i email them like a thank you and asking them if they want to sign up for anything else or buy my personal ebook that i made for social media so that's the plan i'm pretty dehydrated i feel so tired oh also i'm trying to be out of here by six o'clock so it's already dark outside and the sunset was beautiful but i was on a call so i couldn't document it but i am standing next to this window so it was really pretty but anyways i am right now finishing up with my video it's a sponsored video so i do have to submit it and turn it in by today but the good thing about being on east coast time is that we're ahead of everything so like even though it's five o'clock here it's only two o'clock in california so i have pretty much the whole day to edit my video and turn it in which is awesome so that's my favorite part about being on the east coast when i was in la for the summer i hated being on the west coast because i would always have to do things earlier and turn things in like way earlier so this is really nice but editing this video 
finishing it up and then turning it in and then I'm going home because I'm tired. you guys we just got back from a cheese bar with ali and it was so good i've been wanting to go to a cheese bar for so long and we just went to one called like murray's cheese bar and it was delicious it's like ranked one of the best ones in new york city so we just like happened to look it up and yeah it was just it was great really recommend but i ate so much food so much cheese and i feel like cheese is not the best for my stomach um and i just a lot of it oh my gosh i'm like out of breath what the heck is wrong with me and it's also freezing outside you guys so today i feel like is one of the coldest days of the year for new york or of the first winter it's one of the first really cold days it's like 30 degrees outside so i was bundled you guys um it's 8 17 right now i am about to undo my laundry so I got this delivered. I am going to start sending out my laundry because I just don't ever do it. So yeah, I'm making the investment and I'm sending it out. This is actually really cheap. It was only like $20. So it was not expensive at all. And I got like all of this laundry, which is awesome. That's what I'm gonna start doing and I'm really excited about it, but I'm just about to undo that. And then just lay, lay low. I'm tired, you guys. <laughs> Okay, the way that they tie this, how do I undo this? Oh wow, they sent it in another bag like this. Oh, it's all folded, that is so nice. Okay, another bag? I feel like this is a little excessive and a little wasteful. Wow, this is packed so tightly. Just put away all my laundry and you guys, I am literally never doing my laundry again. That was amazing. I only paid like 20 something dollars and it was all folded super nicely. It came in 24 hours, like it was so quick and it was honestly like double the price of me going to the laundromat. So in my eyes, I'm viewing time as money. So it is not worth it for me to go to the laundromat, which is not even on my street in the freezing cold and have to wait there while it's like drying or while I'm doing the laundry and like be on a time crunch. Cause like, yeah, when the laundry cycle is going, it's locked, but once that's up, it's unlocked. And then when it's in the dryer, it's not locked. So you kind of have to wait there. And it's just, it's not worth it for me. I would much rather just get it delivered up and down my floor and have someone pick it up and drop it off that is so much nicer so that's just what i'm gonna do all right guys it is currently 9 38 and i am about to go to bed i am so tired i'm turning the lights off and going to sleep i feel like this vlog was kind of boring so let me know if you guys liked it or not i wanted to show you how i structure my day but i really was working all day so i wanted to give you guys like an actual glimpse of what i do all day because i do feel like there's a misconception on like well what do you do all day you work for yourself you do youtube like you have your consulting stuff like where how do you plan out your day and this day i think was more busy than others but there are a lot of days that are like this i would say probably two to two to three days are like this and then the other two during the week are more chill and then like during the weekends i still do some work but it's not like an all-day sit-down thing it's maybe like three hours on a weekend you know like it's not that much so that's pretty much how i structure a typical longer work day but it was fun filming it i hope that you guys liked it if you guys did be sure to subscribe and thumbs this video up um i hope that you guys liked like the editing style of it too i think i i'm trying in my head i'm visualizing it and i'm doing it differently but i hope you guys liked it i'm about to write in my one a day journal so if you guys have not bought this you guys need to buy one of these for yourself it is a one line a day and it's a five-year journal like a five-year memory journal so basically what it is i'll have it linked in my amazon store so you guys can buy it but you have like one whole day and then you fill in the year here so you do five years so you write down year after year and you keep up with it so i haven't missed a day yet so i am about to do this day and then i'm so excited 
for like when I hit the next year, the following year, I can look back and read what I was doing on that day, which I think is pretty cool. Okay, so I just wrote down my one a day and now I'm about to go to bed. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.